Hey everybody, Ethan Hochul here with the Hochul Real Estate team in Century 21. Today we're here to talk to you about the four things that the 2020 real estate market taught us. Number one, recession does not equal housing crisis. When we went into all this stuff in March of last year, we got the question a lot and a lot of people were concerned about what the housing market was gonna do. Everybody was saying that there was another 2008 coming. Well, 2020 showed us that the exact opposite can happen in a recession. The housing market boomed, um, there was super low inventory, housing prices kept appreciating, and so a recession does not mean a housing crisis. So what happened in 2008 uh, was an anomaly, does not necessarily mean that every recession that we have, that the housing market is gonna drop and we're gonna have depreciating values of homes. Number two, there was a suburban shift happening. What do I mean by that? People are moving from larger cities uh, to more su suburb areas, to more rural areas, so a lot of people are getting out of the city. They want more space. They want to be kind of out of the city. And so we're seeing that a lot, um, not necessarily just here in Des Moines, but also in the large, large cities, New York City, Chicago. We're getting calls from people from California, people that are moving from large areas and wanting not just to find a smaller town, but also a smaller state, less dense states to move to. Number three, a pandemic does not slow down the real estate market. Even though we had to shift, uh, we had to come up, we had to be on our toes, we had to come up with new ways of conducting real estate, um, it d definitely did not slow things down for 2020. Uh, homes were still selling, they were selling fast, homes were still appreciating. Um, as long as we were able, able to pivot, uh, we succeeded. Uh, we were still able to get home sellers out of their homes and sell at high prices. We were still able to get buyers into their homes, and, or into new homes, and take advantage of the super low interest rates during the pandemic. Number four, and to me most importantly, is 2020 showed us that home has never been so important. In 2020, we spent a lot of time in our homes, more than I ever have in a given year uh, with our families, and it made us take into consideration our space a lot more. We had one spouse working from home, or one person working from home, or maybe two people, plus then you had kids doing online learning. So the space and what we needed in a home definitely changed. A lot of people wanted more outdoor living space. They wanted to be able to hang out with their families, not just indoors, but outdoors. And a house truly turned into a home in 2020, a space that we spent a lot of time and made a lot of memories um, in our homes with our families. So those are four takeaways from what the 2020 real estate market taught us. And I hope you got some valuable information on this and we are excited to see what 2021 brings.